hello dear students welcome back to royce and creations youtube channel in this class let us analyze 9th standard english question paper formative assessment 4 along with its answer those who are watching first time please subscribe and share with your friends so even the video the lina wu english in ninth english na fa4 prashna patrike na augala sampoorna uttra gulandhi ke vishleshi sanamakla first main first question Read the given conversation and choose the language function for the underlined sentence. So, we have the conversation and the patient and the doctor have the conversation. So, the patient has to be able to read the conversation. If you have to read the last sentence, doctor, you need to take this medicine twice a day for a week. So, patient, okay, thank you, doctor. So, if you have to thank you, you can read the underline. So, this underline is the language function. So, if you have to read the language function, you can read the language function. So, apologizing, showing gratitude, giving instruction, complaining. So, if you have to thank you, showing gratitude, you can read the language function. So, if you have to read the language function, you can read the language function. Next question number 2. Read the following and choose the infinitive. She promised to help her younger brother. So, here is the name of the infinitive. So, here is the name of the option. Promised to brother or younger to help. So, here is the name of the infinity. To help. So, here is the option D is the right answer. Question number 2. Do as directed. Question number 3. Which one of the following word as one syllable? So, we have a question about reach, silver, venture, paper. So, we have one syllable about reach. So, we have to select one syllable. Question number 4. Combine the word in column A with its collocative word in column B. So, column B is the exact collocative word. So, we have to select A as loud. B is the noise, book, silence and light. So, we have to करेक्ट आगे रो कॉलेक्टिव आवाज़ आप मानते लेते हैं लाउड नॉइस सो हाँ अगर निवो लाउड नॉइस अंतर बर दे वन द हंका नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चंस इन टू और थ्री सेंटेंस ईच सो इली मूर क्वेश्चंस है दे क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव व्हाट काइंड ऑफ लाइफ डिड बगत सिंह डिजायर � so, this is the life of Bhagat Singh. So, Bhagat Singh wanted to live a free and natural life. He did not like the idea of being a prisoner for him. So, Bhagat Singh wanted to live a free and natural life. He did not like the idea of being a prisoner for him. Freedom was more important than living in captivity. Next, sixth question. What is Dr. Abdul Kalam's vision of India in 2020? So, our vision in 2020, Dr. Abdul Kalam wanted India to be literate and free from poverty by 2020. He dreamed of India being led by noble leaders, scientists and technologists work for common people. Next, question number seven. Why did Tom wanted to be a Sikh? सेवेंथ को आधा का आंसर है टॉम वांटेड टू बी सिक बिकॉज़ ही डिड नॉट वांट टू गो टू स्कूल एंड प्रिफर्ड टू स्टे होम एंड प्ले इंस्टेड ही सॉ बीइंग सिक हैज वे टू एस्केप द मोनोटोमी ऑफ इज स्कूल डे सो इधर इस टू निम्न के टू मार्क्स क्वेश्चन आंसर्स नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर आंसर द फॉलोइंग इले आर वाक्य गले के मीर दंते ने वो आंसर्स बरी बेका गुते क्वेश्चन नंबर एट व्हाट इस फ्रीडम एंड हाउ डस द पोइट वांट टू सेलेब्रेटेड इट सो फ्रीडम अंदर ये नो सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द पोइट फ्रीडम इज फ्रीडम ऑफ थॉट एंड एक्सप्रेशन फ्रीडम फ्रॉम सुपरस्टिशियस एंड द बॉन्ड्स ऑफ सोशल लीवल the poet celebrate the freedom of our nation with songs and dance. All rejoice because of attaining freedom from the British rule. Next question number 9. How does a personal feel when he is youthful? So when a person is youthful, they feel strong, energetic and full of life. Youth is time filled with sweet dreams and hopes for the future. Once youth is gone, it cannot be brought back, making it is a precious phase of life. Next question number fifth, write an essay on any one of the following. So, you will give me three essays. You will select one of the three essays. 
ಬ್ಯಾನ್ ಆನ್ ಪ್ಲಾಸ್ಟಿಕ್ ಇಂಟರ್ನೆಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಏರ್ ಪೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ನಿಮಗೆ ಸಂಪೂರ್ಣವಾಗಿ ಏರ್ ಪೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ಗೆ ಆನ್ಸರನ್ನು ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದ್ದೀವಿ ಮಕ್ಕಳು ಫಸ್ಟು ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡಕ್ಷನನ್ನು ಬರೀಬೇಕು ತದನಂತರ ಕಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಏರ್ ಪೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಸೊ ಅದನ್ನು ಸಹ ಬರೆದು ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಎಫೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಏರ್ ಪೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಸೊ ಏನಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಯಾವುದರಿಂದ ಏರ್ ಪೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಮತ್ತು ಏರ್ ಪೊಲ್ಯೂಷನ್ ಆದರೆ ಏನೆಲ್ಲ ಪರಿಣಾಮಗಳು ಬೀರ್ತವೆ ಅದನ್ನು ಬರೀಬೇಕು ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಕನ್ಕ್ಲೂಷನನ್ನು ಬರೀಬೇಕು ಸೊ ಇದಿಷ್ಟನ್ನು ನೀವು ಪ್ರಾಕ್ಟೀಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಳ್ಳಿ ಮಕ್ಕಳು ನಿಮ್ಮ ಫೈನಲ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಮ್ಗೂ ಸಹ ಆಲ್ಮೋಸ್ಟ್ ಈ ಈ ಒಂದು ಇದನ್ನು ಹೆಚ್ಚಾಗಿ ಕೊಡ್ತಾರೆ ಹಾಗಾಗಿ ಇದಿಷ್ಟು ನಿಮಗೆ ಅರ್ಥ ಆಗಿದೆ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ತಾ ಈ ವಿಡಿಯೋನ ಇಲ್ಲಿಗೆ ಏನು ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀನಿ ಹೆಚ್ಚಿನ ವೀಡಿಯೋಗಾ